Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Amethyst Smoke and I'm going to do raindrops on it. I started off with Neltiques Formula 2 and here is Revlon's Amethyst Smoke. I've already got my base coat down and dry. And this was requested by Angel over at Angel's Heavenly Nails and Miss Randy. So I wanted to make sure to get this one done. And this Revlon is a duochrome kind of polish. It, in this light and this angle, it does totally look purple, but you'll see in my swatch photo that there's a little green in there too, so it's, it's very interesting. And for a mainstream polish, I love that. And by the way, welcome to Mainstream Mondays, my first edition. <laughs> this one has a really nice formula. I mean, it looks a little brush strokey, but it, it really does have a good formula. And as it dries down, the brush strokes don't seem as apparent. And here we go. We're going to go in with our second coat of Amethyst Smoke. I really did like this one. I was excited to be able to use it, to finally have time to use it. So there we go with our two coats. And now for some raindrops. Well, let's top coat them first. <laughs> I'm going to do a regular top coat to make sure I get this to dry all the way down and you know, get it nice and solid dry. And then we're going to do something else to it. Now I'm going to top it with pure ice, the frost finish, and make it more matte like. I've already done this to my other nails, and you know when you're playing with these toppers or these top coats that, you know, it takes a little while for it to, you know, go totally mattified or frosty looking. Capping my tip, and I'm going to let this totally dry. Now I'm going to go in, I'm going to use some shesh feet. I'm going to put a little bit out here on my little piece of tape. And I know that's what mats are for, but you guys, I can't even let my mat get messy. I'll be using this little dotting tool. And the way I'm doing this is I'm going to kind of put the dot on and then drag it. And then I'm all in the way you can't see. But that's how I do these little raindrops. You know, raindrops just fall kind of funny. Some of them look like true raindrops and other ones are just blobs. So it's all good, you know, come in different sizes and shapes and colors. At least mine do. You'll see here in just a minute. One more. There we go. Blunk. All right. So there are my basic raindrops. And now I'm going to use the silver northern lights. It's just like a glitter topper. And I'm putting some of that out on my tape. And I'm going to use that same size dotting tool and just go over the other raindrops. And this just gives it a little bit of sparkle, a little bit of glimmer, you know, glistening raindrops. And it's a very simple, you know, design. It doesn't take a whole lot of, you know, a whole lot of extra stuff. It's, you could even use a toothpick for this, so. But there we go. And I am to done. You can see that green flash a little bit now. Ta-da. So here is my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Please leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Bye.